Ida was a very unique teacher. She was a very special teacher because not only was she highly accomplished as an intellectual, she had a PhD in biochemistry as a woman in the 30s. She had trained in Europe, she'd been to Switzerland, she'd studied, you know, uh, biochemistry and physics. So she was a uh, very sharp uh, intellect. She wanted to be able to train people to negotiate their way in a, in a very complex world. Structural integration is a technique which aims at organizing, at ordering a body. If you go back to the 70s, to the early 80s, late 60s, and that period of time, and you realize there was a great spiritual opening there. And what, what's come from that? Well, organic food, good nutrition, women's rights, civil rights, and uh, the human potential movement, which now has become complementary and alternative medicine. We are dealing with an attempt uh, to make a body a sturdier human being, to make it to make a body more secure, more uh, more adequate within the field of gravity. She used gravity as her favorite metaphor, which was that if the system was better balanced in gravity, then it would uh, consume less energy in maintaining itself, and there would be more juice free for expression. The human body is, is immensely complex, but she wanted to be able to give people a, a, a map, a, a, a framework, and if they worked within that framework, they would accumulate knowledge, which would then be a kind of self-instruction. So she invented the 10 session series as a teaching device and as a treatment protocol. She essentially said, follow these Follow this protocol, do this 10 session series, and even though you don't totally understand the deep implications of what we're doing here, you'll get a good outcome. When I met her, um, I realized that you don't get a chance to, I'm gonna choke up, you don't get a chance to meet a woman like this very often.